I'm James Burns from Jedi News and today we're going to be looking at some brand new stamps that have recently come out from the Royal Mail. Back in 2015 to celebrate the release of The Force Awakens, Royal Mail brought out their first ever Star Wars stamps and they went down incredibly well. And every year since then, at Star Wars Celebration and other events, they've been bringing out special editions of those stamps. But we get, for 2017 and for the release of The Last Jedi, we're getting some brand new sta stamps even. Uh, eight brand new stamps. All done by the same artist, the wonderful Malcolm Tween, who's also a good friend of Jedi News. And he's designed some new stamps that feature the droids, creatures, and aliens from The Last Jedi. These eight new stamps are absolutely fantastic, and they're available right now. And you can get them in this fantastic frame, or in various other different guises. Now, earlier in the year, Royal Mail celebrated the 40th anniversary of Star Wars with an amazing set of the original Trinity stamps that were released from 2015 in some special editions. And those are still available, as are all of these stamps, at royalmail.co.uk forward slash Star Wars. We'll put the links and everything in the description. But if you want a more detailed look at those 40th anniversary stamps, then why not head over to the Rancho Obi-Wan page, owned and run by our good friend Steve Sansweet, and he goes into great detail showing you those 40th anniversary stamps in a video similar to this. So let's dive in a little bit further into what's currently available. So I've showed you the frame and the set of stamps that's currently available. What they've also done is in 2015, they brought out some um, uh, starships as well, which Malcolm didn't illustrate, but Malcolm did all of the character work. So what they've done to celebrate his work and the 2015 and 2017 stamps together is that they've actually put them all in one frame, which combines all of the characters that were released in 2015 and also in 2017. And I have to say, I think they've done an incredible job with this and the eight new stamps that they've created for 2017. Amazing stamps they've created for 2017 include Maz Cantana, uh, Chewbacca, Snoke, everyone's favorite, the Porg. It's gonna be really, really interesting to see in a few days exactly how and where the Porgs feature in The Last Jedi. Everyone's favorite astromech droid, BB-8 the wonderful R2-D2, C-3PO, and from Rogue One K2SO as well. So some of the other products that they've done, they've been really, really imaginative in 2017, and they've tried to do some display packs. And there's three different display packs. We've only got one of them to show you today. There's an R2-D2 pop-up 3D display, and we'll be showing you that as a picture uh, whilst I'm talking. There's also a BB-8 display, and both of these showcase all of the eight brand new stamps that are available. In addition to that, there is also this really, really cool lightsaber display. And what happens when you ignite a lightsaber, the lightsaber ignites. And what you can do with this is you have all of the stamps that have come out this year. So these are the 2017, the eight stamps from 2017. And they're green for good. And what you can actually do with this is you can actually put this together uh, for display purposes. So I think Royal Mail done a really, really nice idea with this and as you've seen from the pictures from the R2-D2 and the BBA, really really nice ways to display your stamps. Really imaginative and really really good value as well. If you turn this one around you can go all Sith and then these are the original stamps that Malcolm did for 2015 featuring some of the original trilogy and some of the sequel trilogy characters. Really really nice. I, I think that uh, Malcolm has done a fantastic job, and if, if you haven't seen Malcolm's art, artwork before, then seek him out, and we'll make sure that we put links to his uh, his company, Digital Progression, uh, I believe it's called, uh, in the li in the links and everything down below. So that's one of the display options. We've mentioned R2D2, and we've also mentioned uh, BB-8, and all three are available at RoyalMail.co.uk forward slash Star Wars. In addition to that. Right now, there are two um, coin sets available, one featuring R2-D2 and the other one featuring BB-8, just making sure that those are in shot. And these feature the stamps, the eight stamps, w along with a medallion, which are really nice. The C-3PO um, medallion set is actually ma uh, being made available on the 14th of December to coincide with the release of The Last Jedi in cinemas. Last couple of things that I've got to show you is that when you buy a set of stamps, um, you get them in this really, really nice envelope, which on the back features our lovely Porg friends. Um, and then there's this 
card which actually details everything that um, explains everything about the stamps. There is also a prestige stamp booklet that's coming out on the 14th of December, which features the history of Star Wars and Star Wars stamps. So that's something really special to look out for. And all of these are available at Royal Mail. Last thing I'm going to share with you, uh, really, really reasonably priced and really, really good fun is a set of the eight postcards to coincide with the release of the stamps. These are available. They feature, um, there's one postcard for every single one of the stamps that are available. And they're a really, really nice way to celebrate the stamps and to use to send to your friends, uh, send messages. And obviously they feature all of the characters that we've mentioned. So huge kudos again to Royal Mail and to Malcolm Tween for producing an amazing collection of eight stamps. We are really, really uh, delighted to showcase them. I think Royal Mail uh, are doing a great job with these. Um, so go buy them. Uh, it's uh, royalmail.co.uk forward slash Star Wars. And if you're, send, if you're sending Christmas cards and you haven't sent them yet, what better way to send them with a Star Wars stamp here in the UK and across Europe if you can get hold of them. This is James Burns for Jedi News. Don't forget to like the video down below. Check us out on all our, our social media networks. It's Jedi News UK everywhere apart from Facebook where it is Jedi News. We've got some exciting things coming up on the channel. We'll be looking at a, uh, a brand new TV from Toshiba very soon and the high-end NVIDIA graphics card which has been released again to uh, celebrate The Last Jedi coming out in cinemas. Uh, and lots and lots of other things going on. So keep tuned to the Jedi News YouTube channel and all of our links down below in the description. Jedi News signing off. May the Force be with you. Always.